Alright, what's going on guys? So before I get started, I just wanted to take a moment to uh, admire this uh, beta uh, startup freaking scene. This guy just like chilling here with this fire behind him. Uh, I didn't notice it when I first started up the beta, but you know, this is, this is fucking badass. It's pretty badass. Uh, anyway, uh, without further ado, let's get on with the tour. What's going on guys? So today everyone's been having issues getting on the beta access for the Xbox One. And I'm here to show you a way to get around all of the code not working deal. Alright, so first you want to go to your browser and you want to type in xbox.com. And this way does work, trust me. A lot of people will be like, oh it don't work, but it is working, okay? Um, now you want to hit your name and you want to go down here to redeem code. Then right over here underneath add PayPal, you want to hit change my region. Uh, you can pick any of these. Uh, I did Mexico. People tell me Brazil's been working. Um, don't worry about the all the language and crap. You can hit translate if you're in Google Chrome. Um, so right here, you hit rescue. Obviously, that's not right. Whatever. So once you do that, you go ahead and put your code in and you hit confirm. And it'll go through. Okay, I already confirmed my code, so I can't do another token to show you guys. People offered to give me their token. I'm watching a live stream right now. About 10,000 people. People told me to go ahead and give it to me. Or told me they would go ahead and give me a token. But it, I, I tried it. It wouldn't work because I already redeemed one. So I'm going to have to cancel that one. So now let me take it to my Xbox just to show you that it is going. Um, a lot of people are saying the digital downloads have been working. I didn't do that. I went to GameStop and bought mine. So just to let everyone know, um, if you all bought it from Walmart or GameStop or anyone from that, this way is working. Now, after you do this and it says OK, make sure you go back here to change my region. And you go back and change it to the United States so everything goes back English. Ba bam And then what you're going to do is you're going to go back to your Xbox. So hang on a minute. All right, guys. Welcome back. Now, as you can see in my uh, little preview that this is working it's 52 percent guys okay it's working but let me show you let me step back a little bit and let me show you how to get here so let's say this isn't up there you don't know how to get there your code worked for you so now here's what you're going to do you're going to have to go over here to the store all right you're going to press over go to the games you're going to go to search all right you go to search in the games you got it get it got it good now you're going to type in black ops 3 If I can spell, how do you spell ops? I don't know. <laughs> like ups three and then hit start. All right. So this is going to come up. So, um, I, I researched this a couple times. I did this a few other times. Sometimes like right here where you see black ops three, it's only going to show you like one or two images. And then down in the, like, the corner, like right below this one is going to be like some three little dashes. You're going to have to hit that to view more. But anyway, so you go all the way over until you see right here, Call of Duty beta. You're going to go ahead and click it. Right here is going to say install. You click install and bam, you're done. There you go. My Xbox froze for a minute. That's all right. But that's it. Okay? And this is real. Okay? This ain't a hoax. This ain't, I'm not trying to troll anyone. This actually freaking worked. And for those of you that are kind of skeptical about the whole thing and like, oh, it's going to mess up my, my token or whatever, it's really not. Okay? Let me explain to you what this is, what's going on here. What's going on and what's happening is when you go to an, um, selecting another region is all it's doing is basically the United States servers are overloaded right now. So when you select another region from the Xbox, from Microsoft or Xbox.com, like you select Mexico or Brazil, it's just pinging another server, pinging another computer from across the world. And then it, so it's going over there to verify, verify the code. It's not trying to do it here in the United States because ours is overloaded. People that have the digital copies, they're just working. They're having no problem. If they bought it and pre-ordered it, or, well, I guess it's not pre-ordered, but, yeah, I guess it is pre-ordered. My bad. If they bought it from the Microsoft Store, they're already playing the freaking game, okay? But we're not. If you went to GameStop like I did, you went to Walmart and Kmart or wherever the heck you go to buy your games, it's not working. Game Exchange, whatever. All right? So when you go change your region, it's actually just pinging a whole other computer, and then it's coming back. That's it. Done deal. 
and then we change the region back to English, okay? It's not going to be Spanish, or it's not going to be, you know, Brazil, or whatever the freaking other kind of language you all chose to pick for your region. It's not going to be like that. Why? Because your Xbox is English. Your Xbox is freaking English, okay? So don't be skeptical. It's really working. I'm going to be playing this. You can choose the way if you want to. But, you know, and if it did work, make sure you all drop a like and drop a comment to tell everyone that it's actually freaking working, okay? Can you do that for me? Be like, hey, it's working. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Hit that subscribe button, all right? And this is Squishy signing out, guys. Hope it worked for you, which it will. I know. See ya. Yeah.